Hey dads and coaches, welcome to Whiteboard Wednesdays. I'm Coach Mack with Authority Football. Today we're gonna to talk about another one of my favorite combinations to move the chains and win you games. It's simple, it's effective, it's quick, and it's the double slant combination. So we've got two receivers out here. This does work better with two split out receivers rather than a tight end or something closer. Uh, so it works well with that two receiver side and we're gonna run double slants, okay? Now what we wanna do with those double slants is we wanna stress the number two defender. It's a lateral stress, but this is a flow stress rather than a cross stress. So we want to set up that slant and work inside of number two. And it's pretty simple, okay? Uh, this is a three-step drop combination. If we're under center, it's one step. If we're in gun, we want to throw the ball in less than 1.5 seconds from snap. Uh, and we want to make this guy wrong right here, okay? Now, so the key is, Really simply, what we want to do if you're a quarterback or you're coaching quarterbacks, we want to execute our footwork, make this guy wrong, and we do that by throwing the inside route if he gets inside of it. It's that simple. If we win the inside, throw the route. Okay? So if we get inside at all, you see we've got this lane here we want to work in that we want to throw the football. So if we get inside leverage, we're going to throw that. Now, if this guy collapses that, right, walls that off and collapses that and starts carrying that, obviously he gives us the throwing lane for the outside slant, which is a really easy read to make and is gonna give us a, um, a great run after catch right there as well. So really simple, eyes are in one place and we make a, a simple decision and a quick execution of our footwork and our throw. Now, some coaching points. Problem I see is when we run this slant too flat or we let this uh, defender flatten us and push us down into the problem. The problem is this inside, the number three defender. Corner's number one, outside backer's number two, the number three guy's the inside linebacker. He shouldn't ever get to play football here. So we wanna get inside of that route. And as you see, we're gonna bend that vertical once we get inside so we can keep that throw away from this problem right here, okay? Now, if we get a stack, if that linebacker is way out here, there's really no reason to, to bend hard at all. We just want to get inside and keep it as skinny as possible. If he's really hard in here, we want to still work that thing across. And rather than getting that vertical stem, we're going to go ahead and just push right there to get inside of it. So we end up about in the same place right there. And if he's really far inside, we're probably not going to throw it, but we are going to hold him. We're going to bait him and bring him in and give us the throw we want right there. It's really simple. Three-step drop, make your read. If we get in, it's a win. Make that throw and make him wrong. Check us out next week. We're going to talk about another really effective combo that you can put into your offense and help yourself or your quarterbacks be successful uh, going out and scorching defenses. Thanks a lot. We'll see you then. Hey, this is Coach Mack. If you found this video helpful, make sure to subscribe to our channel.